Family and friends are searching tirelessly for a missing 20-year-old St. Augustine man. Detectives say that he was last seen Saturday evening. Arthur Wagner was spotted riding his dirt bike near Wildwood Drive. Deputies believe he's in danger. News for Jack's reporter Corley Peel went to St. Augustine and spoke with his friends who are combing through a number of counties. Loved ones are searching wooded areas using four wheelers and dirt bikes in hopes to find Artie Wagner searching the trails that he would normally ride his dirt bike. The dense wooded areas of St. Johns County is where family and friends have been searching for missing 20 year old Artie Wagner. Jody Coward and Stefan Schuler rode four wheelers along the heavily wooded trails looking for any clues as to Wagner's disappearance. But we're searching in the ditches. We're searching everywhere because uh, if he, you know, fell and was unconscious or whatever, we just want to make sure we don't pass him up in these ditches because some of these ditches are anywhere in between 15 and 30 feet deep with water. Family members last saw Wagner around 7 Saturday evening. They say he left his home riding his yellow dirt bike near Wildwood Drive. His friends say they had been boating with him earlier that afternoon. He left behind his phone, uh, his wallet, ID, uh, a lot of cash. Um, I, he's never left his phone behind like that before. I mean, I've always been able to get in contact with him, so we're all pretty worried. Loved ones have posted these missing person flyers for Artie Wagner inside restaurants and stores throughout the county. Cower and Schuler covered 70 miles on their four-wheelers on Monday, even finding some tracks similar to Wagner's dirt bike. We went all the way down to Flagler County and, we, you know, found some dirt bike tracks. We don't know if it's his or not, so we followed those as far as we could and, you know, rode around. I believe we had to find his dirt bike to find him. According to deputies, family members told them Wagner recently made threats to harm himself. Loved ones say they won't stop searching for Wagner until he is found. The St. Johns County Sheriff's Office is actively working this case. Those with any information about Artie Wagner's whereabouts is urged to call the Sheriff's Office. Reporting from St. Augustine, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.